You want to get shaders in Minecraft 1.21.8. Well, in this video, we're going to show you exactly how to do that. The first thing you need to do is download the Irish Shaders mod. This is the mod that actually adds shaders to Minecraft. And you can find this link in the description down below, where all you've got to do to access the download page is click Download Irish Shaders. Now, you can also just Google Irish Shaders Download, but make sure you're coming here when downloading Irish Shaders. And once you are here, go ahead and click Download Universal Jar, and the download will begin. Now, you will need to keep or save Irish Shaders, but it's a hundred percent safe to do that so we can go ahead and click save here and the download will begin and while iris is downloading have a quick message from our company simple game hosting go to the first link in the description down below the breakdown.xyz sgh to start your very own 24-hour ddos protected minecraft server and start playing minecraft with your friends in just a few minutes you can easily add mods plugins and mod packs to your server and truly customize your server any way that you want with one click installation of hundreds of mod packs there's even expert live chat support there to help you out so don't struggle to host a server start your server the simple way at the first link in the description down below the breakdown.xyz says sgh nevertheless we have iris downloaded but there's one more thing we need to download and that's going to be a shader pack shaders packs are what actually allows shaders to be in minecraft think of shaders packs like resource packs but for lighting we have a list in the description down below of a ton of amazing shader packs but you can also obviously google for example minecraft shader packs and you can download these typically on Carsforge and Moderinth. So on Carsforge here you can see all of these shader packs as well as Moderinth. Both are trusted sources and actually when we download our shader packs here we're going to be linking out to them on those sites. We'll go ahead and grab BSL shaders as well as make up ultra fast shaders because honestly those are some amazing shaders packs but there's also other great ones on this list as well. Now whenever you are downloading BSL from the site you will need to click BSL shaders here. Click on download and then you're going to want to select. The reason I wanted to do this is because I wanted to show you what both Moderinth and curse words look like. So on Modernth, you would just go to versions here and download the most recent version. It might not actually be for the most recent version of Minecraft. That's okay. Shaders is going to work 99% of the time anyway. We can do this with Makeup Ultra Fast as well, except for on Curse Forge, just go to Files and download that most recent version. Now with everything downloaded, we can go ahead and minimize our browser, and then we want to locate where the files are, which is in your Downloads folder. From here, we can go ahead and double click on the Iris installer, and it should open with Java. If it doesn't, you need to get Java from the link in the description down below or just google java 21 se download but once you're here click download and then download it for windows and the installer here and it installs just like any other program you may also need to run the jar fix that's going to take java and link it to iris shaders making them work together at this point though with the iris installer open make sure 1.21.8 is selected iris only and then click install it will now install iris shaders in minecraft and you're good to go as you can see it is completed now we can close out of the iris installer and actually delete it and we can add our shaders packs to minecraft to do that we want to open up the minecraft launcher and in the minecraft launcher we want to make sure we're playing with our iris and sodium installation now that's already selected for me but if we go to installations here at the top we can make sure modded is checked and see it here as well play minecraft using that and the hard part's done that's the hard part of getting shaders is getting to where you're launching with iris and sodium once you're in game adding these shaders packs to minecraft is super easy all we've got to do is go to options video settings and then at the top shader packs then just drag and drop the shader packs you want to install directly into this shader pack menu boom there they are they are now installed you can delete them if they were in your downloads folder or desktop you don't need them there anymore because they're now in the minecraft folder and we can go ahead and click on for example bsl click apply and it is now active you can change your shader settings in the bottom right by the way it's a great way to kind of for example run low settings if you have a lower end computer but at this point we can jump on to our simple game hosting server and we will be able to see that sure enough the shader pack is live you can actually change shader packs in game as well so we can see bsl shaders is live looking good one of the big changes between these two is going to be the cloud so if we go to options video settings we can go to shader packs and then switch to makeup ultra fast click apply and boom there we go you can see the clouds now changed over here over there it's one of the quickest ways to tell outside of the lighting being a bit different and things like that so there you have it that's how you can get shaders in minecraft 1.21.8 if you've got any questions let us know in the comments but enjoy your shader packs it truly revolutionizes the look of minecraft we'll see you in the next video and i am out peace